How's it going lads? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today what I have for you is 20 of the brand new, well not brand new, but the newly released 82 plus guaranteed SBC with all of the top tier special cards in packs. With team of the season coming to a close, FIFACoinZone.com are starting a brand new thing on their site where they're doing top series packs. Make sure you go check them out and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off. Couple of things before we start, basically. First of all, we're really, really close to 100,000 subscribers. That is my dream goal on YouTube, and we are very close. We're almost at 93,000 right now. Considering we've gained about 5,000 in the last two and a half weeks, that is crazy. I'm so, so grateful for you guys supporting me, subscribing to the channel. Um, I don't think we'll continue the growth that we're at right now, but if we do, that we could hit 100,000 so soon, and it'd mean a lot to me if you guys could subscribe. And the second thing, don't worry, I won't take too much of your time up here. Uh, you're probably wondering, everything looks a bit different in the background. I've just moved house. I've moved house into a brand new house with a bunch of other FIFA YouTubers. For example, uh, Vizza, Nerdfire, Curbs, Brooksy, um, to name four of them. Flair FIFA, to name the fifth. Uh, and myself, six of us, we're all living in this uh, amazing house, which I'm very, very grateful that you guys put me in a position to live here. Um, so yeah, that's why the lighting might be off for this one video. I've ordered a brand new light so that we'll have good lighting for the next video. Um, and that's why the, 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 the whole background has changed, stuff like that. We'll have stuff added to the background for now. It's just kind of boring and bland. But EA released uh, Team of the Week. Well, I don't know if the Team of the Week upgrades just got released. I think I think they Oh, maybe they did just get released. We've got the 81 plus, the 81 to 86, the 82 plus, as you guys saw. Tots upgrade, I icon upgrade so and these all end on wednesday when all special cards got a pack so what i've gone and done is built 20 82 plus upgrades and hopefully we should be able to get some decent special cards from 20 as you know the top tier special cards are all in packs so fingers crossed we can get something decent from 20 and the first one's a walkout very good start it's going to be a team of the season amazing start what's it going to be go on french center back oh this could be good laporte 94 rated team of the season laporte that is a fantastic start i am very happy with that start He's actually really good in game, and worst comes to worst, I can just submit submit him into an SPC, maybe an icon upgrade or a team of the season upgrade if we're feeling saucy. It's the end of FIFA right now. I think this is like EA's last bow out. Now I think FIFA 19 has probably uh, reached its uh, its end cycle. I'd say right about now. You know, it had that had that little bit of time where you know people obviously right now people are still playing it, enjoying it. I think over the next few weeks is when it slows down, ready for FIFA 20, and I think it's like 37 days or something like that which I'm very excited for. Um, so, I think that there won't be too much content in the next sort of month. Um, hopefully, EA just surprises us and we get really good content, but I can see EA slowing down a little bit now. So, this is like the final, you know, here's some really cheap SBCs because they've given really good ratings for this. So, like, it's like 30 chemistry and 5 rare. So, it's not bad. 30 chem is really easy to make. We've got another team of the season, though. What's it going to be? Come on. Argentinian. Oh, it's goalkeeper. It's Benitez. Every time it's Benitez. Why can't it just be right wing for a change or striker? You know, give me an Aguero. That'd be great. I swear that looks nothing like Benitez as well. That doesn't look anything like him, surely. Anyway, my, my brain blown there. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. But um, it's really, really cool. So uh, we've got a bunch of these left to open. We've got, sorry, 16 left. Um, fingers crossed. Oh, we've got back-to-back -back walkouts. Come on. What's it going to be? Another team of the season. Let's go. Come on. That's three teams of the season so far. Ooh. Oh, it's Atal. I don't know why. In my head, I'm thinking Mares, and then I'm thinking uh, Brahimi. Uh, and I remember Mares was an SBC, and Brahimi was a weekly objective. So, yeah, it's kind of out the window, unfortunately. But we'll continue. We shall uh, continue. We've got 15 left. We're only five in. We've had three teams of the season so far. Not a bad return. Sadly, no walkout in this one, though. That's a little bit disappointing. But we continue. I'd hope from 20 to have at least 10 walkouts, maybe more. Uh, with the rate we're going right now from 20, we should have like 12 or something walkouts. So I wouldn't be too bad, to be fair. Um, I think that'd be a decent return. Uh, no walkout in this one as well. Is it going to be a board? It's going to be a board. Any sort of boards and stuff like that are always nice. Um, I think we'll probably get some some SBC, like a player SBC tomorrow, I'm guessing. Um, and then I think we'll probably get like, on Wednesday, I don't think we'll get any content at all. Uh, or I'm assuming so. So tomorrow, if we get a decent like re-release player upgrade, uh, 83s and 84s will be decent for that. You know, they'll be nice to submit into that. So that won't be too bad. Uh, what we got? Come on. Walkout again. Let's go. Come on. What's it going to be? It's going to be another team of the season. Come on. What's it going to be? German. Striker. Oh, it's Volland. I mean, Zac Efron. <laughs> oh, I really thought that might, might have been Timo Werner. Now, Timo Werner is actually really cheap. However, 
you know, it would have been nice to have him in trade, but it was just a weird... I don't know about you guys. Let me know down below if you guys are the same as me. I have a weird connection with uh, tradable and untradable cards. Untradable cards just feel so much more precious to me. If I get a really sick card that's, like, incredible and it's untradable, I have a weird close connection to that card. Don't know about you guys. Let me know down below if you're the same as me, but I don't know. I just have a weird connection to it. And Like, if I pack something great that's untradable, it's like the idea of... Being able to use that card now to the rest of FIFA and having no reason to sell it. And then, you know, if I get angry at the game, I don't rage sell it. I don't know. In my head, psychologically, I just, I'm happier with it. But we've got another team of the season. That's five so far. Spanish. Center mid eyes. Canales, isn't it? Oh, it's Sarabia. I mean, it's not bad. I think it's the best center mid we could have got. Um... 94 rate. I've actually used this card actually in game, man. It's a really, really good card in game. He's one of those cards that's always super. It's going to be super cheap because it's kind of boring Spanish La Liga. No one really cares about that, but he's actually really, really good in game. He's got some fantastic in game stats and uh, he's a very, very good card to use in game. I think I had his red card at one point. I used it in a few games and he actually played really well for me. Um, so that's not bad at all. As we move in, we've got the final 10 left now. Come on, see you another walkout, EA. No walkout again. Any, what are you doing to me? Not even a board this time. That's kind of disappointing. I'd imagine there's probably not a whole lot of non-boards actually ready to be packed. I think there's probably like three or four, maybe something like that. 82 rated that you can pack in these because the rest of them will be special cards and stuff. So, yeah, hopefully we stay away from those those individual cards, hopefully. Um, another walkout, though. Come on. Is it going to be another blue? It's not, actually. It's a man of the match this time. What's it going to be? Yeah, I thought it might have been. I thought it might have been to lesson. He's like everyone's go-to man of the match, which, by the way, if you pack this guy in, for example, a 125 uh, ultimate pack for rivals or a 100k pack in, in champs, there is a very good chance that you will have a team of the season or some good plays behind him. Uh, man of the matches this year have like a 15,000 coin uh, discard value and start price. So 15,000 coins is what they sort of discard for and start at, uh, meaning that they have, because they have a higher discard value, they'll, they'll appear over, for example, a team of the season Ronaldo or a team of the season Messi or something like that because their team of the season Ronaldo uh, discard price is like twelve or 13,000 coins. So that's pretty much how it works with packs. I don't know why. It's a little bit strange. It should always just be rating, in my opinion, but it's how EA do it anyway. Uh, but we've got like seven left. Is that Robin? Oh, that's a decent pack. 85 rated Robin, not bad. I-N Robin. I doubt he'll be 85 next year. I think if... Wait, has he... Re I know I know he got an end of an era card. I don't, I don't think he's retired, though. Pretty sure he just moved clubs. Anyway, we've got another walkout. We're going to stop talking about that. It's going to be another... Oh, it's not a blue. It's a UCL card. Who's this? Jovic? No. Tadic. Not great, unfortunately. I, I would have preferred his 95 rated Tots card. Um, 86 rated though is not bad again for SBCs and stuff like that. Maybe we do a couple of TOTS upgrades after this or something. Um, depending on if we get a few more TOTS in these packs. TOTS upgrades are always fun to do. So maybe we go and go ahead and do one or two of them. We've got another team of the season though. These are basically TOTS upgrades anyway. We've got German. Right wing back, De Costa. I already have a De Costa. What I might do is actually use this De Costa to go ahead and do a Tots upgrade, as I already have De Costa. Um, so what I might do is swap these over, because this is this is the one that I use. Uh, and I will go ahead and do a Tots upgrade with De Costa, because I know, I know it's the end of FIFA, and I know you guys are probably thinking, just discard it. The way I see it, basically, is that it's almost like it, it just helps with the tots upgrade so i'm gonna go ahead and build this and i'll be back in just a second tots upgrade done just like that so we have another pack to open and uh, we'll go ahead and claim ourselves the douglas costa as well uh i think that just makes life a little bit easy to be honest i think that it's a nice way to just submit an untradeable keep mine and uh, and we have one more pack to open at the end as well which is going to be a guaranteed team of the season so that's pretty fun um no walkout in that pack though disappointingly enough come on yeah we want to see some decent pulls here we want to see uh, from how many we got we got four left i want to see at least two walkouts outs that would be my goal and we haven't got one of them yet so it's kind of looking unlikely we're gonna get two now uh bruno fernandez though shame he didn't come to united I'm, I'm i'm disappointed we couldn't actually finalize that deal as a united fan uh but it is what it is you know uh no walkout again all right we're gonna have to get back to back walkouts in these last two packs to make it to make my prediction slash hopes and dreams come true it, is it possible it's not possible. Damn, EA, you're doing me dirty here. You're doing me dirty, EA. What are you doing? Oh, I mean, he should have been a walkout because he's an 84 rated special card, but he's not for some reason, but we'll take it. If we get a walkout in this, our class is back-to-back -back walkouts. Okay, we didn't. 
<laughs> never mind then. Never mind. Uh, not a bad end to 20 of them. We got, you know, some high rated team of the season pools and we get to do a team of the season pack as well for basically free. So not too bad. Um, if I were you, I don't know which is better at the 82 plus or the 81 plus. Last time I did the 81 plus, so I decided to do the 80 plus, uh, uh, 82 plus this time. In terms of value, I think it's fun just to do at the end of the game. If you guys can just, you know, get together some players. I think it's a really fun SBC to do at the end of the game. Oh, what we got here then? Madison. That's not too bad. I mean, it's all right. Um, so if you've got some coins, you've got some players in the club, you want to open some packs up or something like that. It's fun to do at the end of the game, in my opinion. You'll get to use some special cards. Maybe get one that you've never used before, like a Tots Messi or a Tots Ronaldo, and you get to use that. Depends how lucky you are, to be honest. With that, when I've got a team like this, I don't care about using my coins on these, these SBCs because it's just fun, really. It's just a bit of fun. If you guys have enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel. We're so close to 100k. I'd greatly appreciate the subscription. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate the support. And thank you for allowing me to live in a house by myself and not rely on my parents. I really appreciate that you guys watch and support me. I'm, I'm genuine. I really mean that, honestly. Like, it, it's unreal. I'm so grateful. So thank you all from the bottom of my heart. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you later.